police are trying to put an end to profiling by finding out more about you. At least those of you they stop. Denver Chief Robert White told us today the data collection effort is in part a response to the officer involved shootings around the country. Well, Denver 7's Mark Boyle spoke with the chief today. And, Mark, you're already hearing from people who have concerns about this program. That's right. And one of the big concerns is how long it'll take for those officers to collect and enter that data. When they're in their car and they're entering it on their computers, they're not out patrolling the streets. Now, this is a very new idea. And Chief White knows there are still a lot of question marks. A big time data collection effort for Denver police is set to roll out by year's end. And Chief Robert White says it's as much for the department's use as it is for those who live in Denver. It speaks to transparency. Yeah. I, I can't say that as a result of this, we're going we're gonna to get a better outcome. I mean, I mean, hopefully the information will show that we're, that we're not doing any, any kind of profiling. The effort is being modeled after the data collection in California, which wasn't set to be done until 2018. Chief White says Denver can't wait that long. We want to collect the right data. Uh, we want it to be meaningful data, and we want to make some sense out of it. Uh, so, you know, I, I'm, obviously I'm concerned about the course, but I'm probably more concerned about it being done efficiently, effectively, and timely also. Officers will be gathering data like race, gender, age, among others, usable data that won't take officers off the streets any longer during suspicious stops. If it's going to take an officer 10 minutes for every stop to, every stop to collect data, and, and they're making 20 and 30 stops a day, that's a lot of time being taken away when they should be out there protecting uh, and patrolling those neighborhoods. Denver is modeling after cities like Chicago, LA, and New York, too. But Chief White admits there is still a lot of work to be done before they're ready to hit the streets with this effort. We needed to do it in a way that was effective, that was meaningful, uh, that was productive, uh, and it was something that could be managed within our budget. Now, Chief White says if this goes the way that he thinks it will, and that's that it will be successful. He's hoping this could be a model for other de departments across the state that would like to do the same thing. Live in Denver, Mark Boyle, Denver 7.